ticket regularly, please. Oh, sure. Oh. Hello guys, welcome back to Sim UK's rendition of Bus Simulator 2016. And in case you missed it, here's what happened at the end of the last episode. And obviously at the end of this run, we're hoping, fingers crossed, that we'll have ticked all four boxes and moved on to the next level in one hit. That would be superb. Whoa, that was close. That was close. That was 100% my fault. I say 100% my fault. I didn't crash, so 100% well done me. But uh, yeah, there was a moment there where I thought the crash was imminent. So, I know I've been chatting about OMSI quite a lot in this video um, and I think the, the reason for that is because this game is lacking some of the fundamentals that OMSI 2 has already um, but this game has enough potential where if, if modders are permitted to get on and build some maps themselves and I'd love to see some new buses Just feel we're a bit lacking in the bus department. And the buses that are available could be more detailed internally, I think. The other day, sir, I got the scare of the day. What happened? Apparently, my roommate Thank you very much. So if if the developers open this game up and let the modders step in and evolve it, then this game is going to be a fantastic purchase. Driver, the door hasn't been closed. Oh man, the door hasn't been Next closed. St. Andrew's Church. Uh, excuse me, dude. Yeah, you. Could you please... Sorry. Yeah. Standing in the door clearly isn't a good thing, is it? Why can't I shut this bloody door? Shut! This is the only reason it wouldn't shut, because that dude was sat there. Stood there. Oh, goodness me. Oh! Nearly went then. Yes, it is a green light. That interrupted me somewhat. So this game has great potential. It really does. Um, I just get... Yeah, alright love. I just get the impression that the developers of this game, like the developers of OMSI 2, um, are kind of disinterested in finishing the project, making it all it can be. St. 
making their customers happy, which is a concern. I hope I'm completely wrong. If I'm completely wrong, then this is awesome. Or at least it will be. Thank you. Have a great I want to day. buy a ticket. On a regular trip. Thank, Thank you. you. Very much. Goodness me, this is a long trip, isn't it? We're nowhere near the end. Oh man, we missed a late passenger. I didn't even see them. Blast. Normally I look as well, this time I didn't. Ding! I'd like to get off. Well, it seems that this route, the next bus stop is quite far away. A good four minutes to get there. Thank you for travelling with us. Hello gents. Okay, you don't know each other, that's fine. The lights seem to be with us, the traffic seems to be with us. So far, other than missing that passenger, this has been a good run. And let's be Village fair, Street East. that passenger was a late passenger. So how angry can she be, you know, or he? One of the key differences between this and OMSI 2, I don't want to keep going on about OMSI 2, I apologise, but one of the key differences is that OMSI 2 is running a very strict um, bus route. Whereas on this one, I mean, you can be as late as you want, really, and it's not, it's not the end of the earth. Oh my God, we're driving on the right, not the left slip back into UK mode. <laughs> um, yeah. I mean, let's put it this way. OMSI 2 is a simulator, a bus simulator, and bus simulator is a game at the moment. It's got all the pieces it needs to become a simulator whether or not the developers want it to become a simulator, I guess. Hello. To regular. 440, thank you so much. Thank you, dear. Hello. Hello. Can you help me with a ticket? One senior. Thanks. You're welcome, mate. Day. You too, bud. See, in OMSI, <coughs> that woman would have just walked out in front of us, regardless of the fact that we were already there. I, do you know, I almost didn't see that car. Kind of blended in with all the other cars. Oh, oh, what was that? 
glitching and shaking about all over the place. Okay, this is a bit of a wibbly wobbly route. We could really do without this level of complexity. Although it does make it more challenging, which makes it more fun. So. Six of one, half a dozen of the other. So we're turning right here. Don't, don't you dare. Wow. So what does happen on this is that pedestrians walk out in front of AI cars and AI cars will stop without they seem to stop incredibly quickly, which can catch you out. And I mean, I didn't see his brake lights come on then at all, but he just stopped all of a sudden. I was kind of expecting it, so it wasn't a big deal, but that's what happens in this game. In OMSI, they tend to drive into you regardless. Although it did say in the tutorial yesterday that if you flash your headlights, that is giving them permission to pull out in front of you or whatever and the same applies if they flash you they're saying I'm not gonna go help yourself to the to the road or the turning or whatever nice all the lights seem to be with us oh, let's get over Day. Thank you for travelling with us. Thank you. Hello. I don't know why, but I'm sensing a late passenger. <laughs> nope. Red herring. And we're going left here. Look at this, the lights are with us again. Green. Gee, green, they're green. Go. What the heck? What are you doing? The lights are green, and if you don't go, they won't be green for much longer. Will you please go? Where's the horn? Is there a horn? Wow. What an a-hole manoeuvre that was. Well... Here you get those kind of drivers everywhere, not just in Britain. Go on then. Whoa, are you having a bubble? Outrageous. Absolutely outrageous. Oh, yeah. I hear the blues and twos. Hawaii Five O, the fuzz, the pig, the filth. Guess what? You get police vehicles and ambulances in OMSI 2 as well. <laughs> that equally is random in their manoeuvres. Hello. Everybody. Sounds local. Maybe we're nearing the end of our route here. Does anyone else smell burnt toast? Am I imagining this? 
think we're mightily close to that green car then. Having absolutely zero resistance on the steering wheel is not giving me a good sense of cornering or whatnot. That's my excuse, so I'm sticking to it. Yep, go on, cross in front of me. Hello there. I need a ticket. Do you really? Are you serious? She seems shaking his money at me. Uh yeah. Thank That's you, you done, much. mate. The impertinence of the man. Like I wasn't gonna give him the correct change. Totally wasn't going to give him the right change. Anyway, this is us. Let's make sure we block this road. Next stop, Villages End. Oh, this come on, somebody stop. let me go. Make sure to take all of your belongings with you before stepping off the bus. This is the last stop. Superb. It's been a pretty good run. I'd like to see a revenue in the 5,000 euro area, if that's humanly possible. Oh, oh, nearly stacked it right on the last corner there. Good Lord, it's so hard driving with the steering wheel that has no resistance. Whoa, what the hell? He's just messing with me. I've got two games of this running at the moment, one to sort of get used to it and this one which I'm videoing and putting live. I've seen some interesting things on the other one which I'm not going to tell you about until it happens on this one. But um, it seems that the, the more you get into the game the more stuff happens. So where it seems really quite basic to begin with, um, some events do occur that you might not otherwise have expected. And that's all I'll say on the matter for now. But hopefully we'll stumble across these things a bit more a bit more often. And you'll get to see them first hand right here. Here we go guys. Everybody off. Thank you so much for travelling. Please do come travel with us again. Or something along those lines. Right, let's go. Back to the base. Oh, almost bang on what I was looking for. 5,160. That's awesome. And I didn't lose any money for missing that passenger, which is perfect. Ooh. Oh, see how close we were to going up two levels. That's, I bet you if we'd have picked up that passenger, we'd be level seven now and we'd have achieved all of our objectives in one hit. Look at that. How close. Blast. So sorry, guys. Uh, we're not going to complete this one this time, but clearly in the next run, we'll have this ironed out. No issues whatsoever. So please join me for that. I look forward to it. I hope you do too. Bye for now.